finally NA East is getting their own cup. That's right boys, my boy Emad now has his own cup and it is NA East. I swear, it seems like everyone is getting their own cup, which is absolutely amazing. They're super fun to watch or play. And in this video, I will cover everything you need to know about the new EMAT cup, including how to register, the format, the price pool, the dates, and everything else. But before we jump in this video, please leave a like and subscribe if you enjoy these type of updates. But after you've done that, let's jump in the video. So if you search up Emad on Twitter and just scroll down, you can see his cup right here. So right off the bat, we can see that it is trios. The tournament is going to be two rounds as always, and you can register down here. So let's click on it and let's see all of the details. All right, the Emad cup, it starts on July 14th, 2 p.m. and it ends at 10 p.m. Now, no, it's not eight hours. This is because it's two rounds. So the first round is going to be three hours and there's going to be a two hour break and then three hours again. And of course, the region is NA East. Finally, I am so hyped for this. And platforms, of course, any platform there is. Now everyone is going to be in the same lobby, so the tournament is cross-platform. But now let's go over the scoring. And honestly, I'm really liking this. So as we can see, each elimination is only one point. And then from top 30 to top 24, you get one point each. Then from top 21, to top 15 you get 2 points and then from top 12 all the way to top 2 you get 3 points and for a win you get 6 points. So let's do some quick math right here. Okay so if my math is correct you can get up to 36 points from placement alone. So if you look at the placement to elimination ratio it's 36 to 1. That means you need to get 36 skills to match the placement. Which means that this tournament is focused on placement. Because I would say anything above 20 to 1 ratio is focused on placement. So this is a beautiful format and you should definitely, definitely be playing for the endgame. And as for the prize pools, here they are. As you can see, top 1 gets $1,667. Top 2 gets $834. Top 3, $334. And then top 5 gets $250. Now these price pools, talking about the numbers, are like super weird because why are they not even? Now if you're trying to split this money between your trio evenly, you can't. So someone is going to get more money than the other. Now obviously it's like 1 or 2 dollars. But why did Ema choose? I mean it is just so weird. Whatever bro, it doesn't really matter. But yeah, top 5 people get the money which is pretty solid. I mean, it's only $10,000. Of course, it's not gonna be like a huge prize pool where like top 100 players or teams, I guess, get money. But yeah, these prize pools are very odd. I'm not gonna lie to you. And also, as you can see right here, top 33 players move on to the round two. So round two is only gonna have 99 players. So the lobbies are gonna be the same every single game of the finals. Which is pretty good in a way, because everyone knows where each person drops or each team drops. But of course, the bad thing about this is that, well, only 33 teams get to that round too. Obviously, I would rather have like, I say like 100 teams get into the round too, but it's what Emad chose and that's fine with me. I'm definitely going to be watching his stream if I'm unable to qualify for the round too. And also, leave a comment down below if you're hyped for this cup. Because I know I am, boys. I'm gonna pop off. Well, hopefully. I don't know. Okay, and now let's go over how to register. So as always, it is super duper simple. You just click register down here and you're done. You just have to make sure you're signed in with your Epic and you are chilling. Now, yes, you do need 2FA and you need to be 13 plus to play in this tournament. So make sure you do have 2FA enabled. Okay, so once you've done that, you just go to your compete tab, you go over to this cup, and it's right here. It's gonna be available in 12 days as of for now when I'm recording this. But yeah, it's that simple. And if you're wondering what all of these tournaments are, I made a whole video about all of these. So make sure to check it out in the top right corner. But yeah, this is some amazing news because now NA East is also getting their own tournaments. So hopefully there will be much more tournaments coming in. And hopefully other regions get tournaments as well because I know Asia has like no tournaments which absolutely sucks. But hopefully they do give you guys tournaments. And leave a comment down below 
who do you think will get the next tournament? I'm thinking Tfue might get his own tournament, because obviously he's very popular. But of course, I will make a video on any other tournaments that may come out. So make sure to subscribe and leave a like if you enjoyed this video. But that's gonna be it. Peace out.